Daddy, I remember when you took me and brother to the zoo. It was the best time ever. I, I will remember when you took me to get some snow cones. That was the best time I had. I love you. So we were in San Antonio and we were getting ready to ride the Steel Eel, which is 3,700 feet tall. It is one of the biggest rides in the world. We were terrified and BJ was in front of me. And as the ride was clicking up, you know, the little clinkers going up the roller coaster, I literally heard him saying, la 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 And right before it dropped, he screamed, I'm a chicken, Lord! And it dropped and he's and he was screaming and crying and we were all screaming and yelling, but we were all laughing extremely hard after the ride because we had never saw that side of BJ. Like BJ was a rough, tough, you know, big guy. But at the same time, like it was it was enlightening and refreshing to see him like open and just having a good time. And that's a very, you know, a happy memory I have of sharing with my brother. Uh, but nonetheless, I just want to say, hey, BJ, I love you, man. I'm proud of you. I cannot wait to see what God has in store for you because I know it's going to blow everyone's minds, especially yours. So just keep doing what you're doing. Keep being a servant of Christ. Keep being an excellent man of God. And love you, man. I love you with the utmost uh, love of God as well as from my own heart. Uh, two times in the scripture do I read about uh, the fathers speaking concerning Jesus Christ. And uh, first of all, he speaks of him at the beginning of his ministry and then at the end of his, at the middle of his ministry. He speaks of him again. At the beginning of his ministry, he says, the heavens opens up after Jesus was taken up from the water and he says, this is my beloved son in whom I am well pleased. But then the second time he speaks of him, he speaks of him on the mountain of transfiguration. And he says to those who were there, this is my beloved son, hear ye him. So I want to say to my son, you're my beloved son, and, and I love you, and I am well pleased with you. Three things I'll leave with you, and I'm done with this little video. Uh, first of all, uh, keep God first, and he'll take you places that you've never been before. Number two, make your family your first mission and ministry. Uh, keep them, and the Lord will allow you to keep others. Um, because a man is not measured by the accolades and the pats on the back and the words of gratitude, from others, but he is measured in the eyes of the Lord by how he is seen in his own household at the end of the day. Um, finally, I will say to you, enjoy the journey uh, and thank God for the opportunity because it is an opportunity that uh, only the Lord can give. And uh, as long as you're not complaining on the mission, I guarantee you, you will have fun and enjoy the ride. It's that simple. I love you always. Uh, please be blessed and have an awesome Sunday morning. And um, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.